What's up, the world? It is your friendly neighborhood slipgator here. And, uh, yeah, stuff and things. Uh, the quick way down. <laughs> so I had to come up here to pick up some stuff. Let's head down to the grotto and, uh, look at the station. I need some, I got some of that, some smooth stone. Hope you guys are all doing good. Thanks very much for coming by this afternoon, this evening, this morning. Whatever diggity day it is for you. Uh, I have a lot of smooth stone in here. I have a lot of crap in my inventory. Um, I've been working hard, guys. I've been working hard. What do I want to get rid of? Let's get rid of some of this cobble. So, uh, yeah, I've been working on the, the grotto. It is Friday. Got the weekend off. Got a busy weekend plan, guys. Might head up to Home Depot. No, I'm just kidding. I'm hopefully going to get a lot of digging done, but I do have a lot of stuff to do this weekend, too. So let's go down and just kind of look at... Did I just ruin? No, I didn't. So... Here's kind of what I decided to do, and I needed some smooth stone because some smooth half slabs. Um, so I wanted to finish off the floor here. Uh, but one of the biggest things that I was thinking about doing, you know, I want to make it look nice. But one of the things that I was thinking about is this lighting issue, and I really needed, you know, I was having trouble with lighting. And I really didn't want stuff to spawn. And uh, I was kind of like thinking, why don't I just cover the whole floor and half slabs, wouldn't that make sense? Because now, you know, nothing can spawn in here. Um, and I think the floor looks good like this. I really like it. Um, I might end up putting, changing these pot lights around, changing these lights around a little bit. Uh, maybe putting just like a piece of glass on top. Um, just to kind of seal the deal there. But uh, you can see this says the branch now. And if you're unfamiliar, that is the mine. So let's go ahead and hit this bad boy. And uh, I did some digging. So this heads down in here into the ravine. Pretty nice. Uh, pretty nice little ride. Really beauteous and glorious and beautiful. And uh, we head down here into the branch mine. And I cleaned up the branch mine a little bit. You know, I just want to make it look nice. And I'm pretty, pretty sure I'll end up putting uh, some cobble stairs down in through here. Maybe incorporate some wood. I don't know. It doesn't need to be pretty here. Uh, it's just my branch mine. But um, I did want to make it a little bit prettier, so I kind of changed some stuff around. I might put a couple more furnaces over there. But uh, then we head back in, and uh, we'll pop us right back up. And everything's working with this, so that is good. We're pretty pleased. I went up and lit up some of the top of the ravine there. I was getting some mob spawns in there. Um, and I just really don't hang out there very much, so I didn't really realize it. But, um, yeah, I mean, I think the solution's nice, and I kind of, even if you do run over these little deposits, these little holes, I don't know, it kind of does suck. <laughs> in a way, it kind of sucks, but I don't know. I like the floor better like this. Tell me what you think in the comment section. Tell me if you like the floor better. Um, I tried a bunch of crap over here, and I was thinking we would try something else right now. And uh, we gotta head back up because I have some lapis, and the the kind of the theme down there is smooth stone and blue. You know, we got the water, but we kind of got you know stuff got effed because we we had the jungle biome intersecting with the beach biome, and it just wasn't working out as far as uh, not appropriate wasn't working out as far as uh, those little water columns, but I have 64 lapis blocks here, and I almost have enough lapis for another block, for another uh, stack of 64. So I thought that we might... I gotta drop some stuff off in that chest down there, man. Holy crap! I thought that we might uh, try one more thing and uh, put some lapis back here, but first of all, let's get rid of some of this crapola. No, I want those. No, 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 no. Go away, go away, go away. Go away, go away. Yeah, I'll just take the 20. All right, all right, okay, okay, okay. So what if we did this? Well, that's going to cover it up. Ugh, gosh. These super high-performance picks are a pain in the eeth. So, all right, let's, uh, let's pillar up. Put some more lighting in over here. Like so. Perfect. 
Perfect. Can't handle my big stick. All right, like that. And then what if we put lapis like this? I don't know if this will look good or not. I think that blue block looks pretty pretty kick ass. Like so. Stand back and have a look at her. It just kind of looks neat, and I think that might be what we do on both sides. It doesn't really need to be anything amazing, but I just think it kind of looks neat. We can incorporate maybe some lapis over here. In fact, you know, it might work. Of course, I can't get that. Of course. Might look cool if we did this. Like so. Hmm? Hmm? What do you guys think? I think it's winter, winter chicken dinner. I think that's, ugh, oh, ugh. Oh. No. No. Ugh, so much fail. Let's fix this up real quick. I need to get Uh, let's see, where do those repeaters go? Here they are. What direction do they go in? Back this way? Oh, oh, that's gonna be simple. What a douche. What a douche I am. Oh my gosh. So I hope you guys are all having a good day today. Your weekend's coming up. I hope that's going to be going good for you. Let's be really careful. Really careful with this thing, damn pick. It is super powerful. And uh, let's, uh, fingers crossed, I didn't F anything else up. All right. Let's be really easy. So I think this is win, and I think that we can incorporate some more of the lapis. Um, I think maybe if we just build another one of these right over here, it'll probably look pretty good. Let's try it out. So I've been getting a lot of questions about the spawner. I think it's probably my, my highest watched vid at this point. Um, the biggest thing, and I talked about it last time, and I've had a few people say, I know this is kind of this is kind of redundant because we talked about this yesterday, but. Um, a few people are having trouble, and really I can't stress enough how much I, I believe that for the people that are having trouble, it's a spawn antenna. Gotta have that spawn antenna. So let's just make sure this is all lit up here. And then we want we want to kind of put a, a, f a heavy base back here because um, we need to dig, I think, too deep. build up that so yeah watch the last episode episode 30 if you're having trouble with the spawner check out the spawning antenna you can also just google uh, or search on YouTube high altitude mob spawner um, okay now I'm gonna be lost because I closed off uh, uh. <laughs> yeah yeah search on YouTube high altitude mob spawner I think here. No? <laughs> we made it back. Six or a half dozen it worked. So but I'm hearing a bad guy. I'm hearing some bad hombres somewhere. Thankfully, they're not in here. Yeah, I really like that lapis. I think that lighting's cool. I think it's pretty simple, pretty cool. And I just, I shouldn't have put all this up, but, uh, whatevs, whatevs. 
It's all good. Yeah, it looks kind of neat, right? But um, I have this tendency to start projects and not finish them. So, or I get distracted. And like today, all I was thinking about is building a building a sugarcane harvesting uh, facility. And uh, I was like, oh, I gotta get home and do that. And uh, I, I was on my way home. I was like, you know, I really should probably finish something uh, once in a while because <laughs> because it would be nice if we had stuff and things that worked. I'm gonna have to get some more glowstone, aren't I? I need four, I have three, I think I got more over here. Yeah, I think then, I don't know if glass is gonna look good. We might have to rethink the center lighting scheme. I got more regular glowstone. I got this stuff. I don't know, like I said, I always appreciate you guys' comments. You guys have left some great ideas. I've actually been recently thinking about revisiting the, uh, where the uh, piston gate is. I think it was, I can't remember if it was Tony or VT Gamer. Somebody cool suggested that we put a, uh, connect the two towers over the, uh, over the piston gate. And uh, I, I still think that's not a bad idea. Um, and I think I might try go back to do that. But what ends up happening all the time is I get distracted by making stuff. And, uh, Okay, I think I just effed that all up. Um, okay. That was my, uh, my tweeter. Sorry, guys. I just wasted all that glowstone. It makes me feel good. It makes me feel real good about myself. And this is such a plain... It's so plain, it's just that I never see... I never see lapis being used, or so rarely. Um, I just think it's kind of cool. Let's see if we can get in there. Oh, so good. No, we don't want cobble there. Uh. So, in other words, keep those comments coming. I appreciate it. I do like uh, talking to you guys and uh, hearing what you have to say, so... Yeah, keep them coming, peeps. Appreciate the support. Um, always need to kind of hear like what you guys think is cool, what you like, what you don't like, because um, that shit's important to me. Like it's important that uh, that I do a good job, and uh, especially that uh, the people that subscribe they like what they see. Oh, uh, and I'm sure failing, constant failing, is not among the things that are super entertaining. Yo, Slip, could you misplace some more glowstone so that we can watch you place glowstone multiple times? Uh, I was hungry. Oh, I didn't know if I talked about it either. Um, another cool video, uh, Minecraft video came out, and I really liked it, and, uh, some people, I guess, in the comments thought it was really boring. Um, I thought it was cool. Oh, let's go ahead and uh, shut that off for now. Sorry, guys. I apologize. So I think it's nice. I like that. I like it. Yeah. I think it's good. It works with the room. It works with the blue. Maybe we can put some more, like some smaller pieces here and here. Yeah, some more lighting, like right there and right there. Because I'm end up... I like to take most of the torches out of here. Yeah, it might be cool. Can we do... Two, three, four, like five. Let's see here. Yeah, we could do a little fiver on each side right here. What do you guys think? I say let's do it. It'll be pretty cool. Um, other than that, not much has been going on. There was a uh, a shooting here today. Well, not here. Not like in my... Not here. I didn't shoot anybody. But um, at the Rockville Metro, 
So this is kind of, sometimes I'm, I'm going to make sure I explain stuff, and then if you guys already kind of know this and it's common knowledge for you, i um, not trying to talk down to anybody or anything, but um, should we make it bigger? No, we can't. I think that's as big as it gets. That's what she said. Uh, the metro is the kind of like the subway. It's what they call the subway down here. Um, they don't call it a subway because it's not completely underground. The metro goes above and below ground. Uh, but, you know, I'm in the D.C. area, so there's a huge amount of commuter traffic. Like, nothing I've ever seen in my life. I've lived a few different places, and I have never seen anything like uh, what goes on around here on a daily basis. I mean, literally hundreds of thousands of people uh, moving to and from work every day. And it's just uh, kind of... Ooh, is that going to work perfectly? It is, except... We're going to need more glowstone. So, oh gosh, I hope I have some because I'm really liking the idea. I'm getting pretty psyched. Um, hundreds of thousands of people. Hundreds of thousands. I commute every day. It is unbelievable. It takes me about an hour and 20 minutes in the morning to make it the, uh, I think it's like 30 miles. And it's an hour and 20. Uh, but, uh, so, at the metro station in Rockville... Oh, look at that. Big old fat stack. I got 18 lapis left. Should I probably should. Where is my lapis? Let me take one, two, three, four. Oh, I'm so full of crap. We'll make some more lapis too. But yeah, there's a shooting, and it kind of freaks me out. Like, the first, uh, when I had first moved here, um, somebody shot. God! God! Yeah! K.I.? Uh, somebody shot at the uh, at the White House. Like, <laughs> I was like, what? Like, somebody had a gun, and they shot at the White House, it, which is, like, down the street. You know, well, it's, like, 30 miles away, but uh, in main terms, that's, like, right down the street. Uh, derp. And, uh, yeah, it's just kind of crazy. Like, that stuff happens down here, uh, and it kind of freaks me out. I wonder if I got enough. Nope. God. Damn it! We'll just make some stacks here. I mean, it doesn't really scare me, like... But it is just kind of odd coming from, you know... I lived in Pennsylvania for a long time in uh, Central PA. And yeah, they got a lot of guns. They got a lot of gun-toting Lutherans over there. But uh, they don't have a lot of shootings and, you know, lived in Maine. We have a ton of guns and, you know... Uh, there's a lot of hunting that goes on, and and I'll be honest with you. I mean, in the in Maine, people get shot sometimes because they're the woods when they're not supposed to be, or you know, there's just a mistake, or it was a, an accident. But uh, normally, it's not because like it's not for like a watch or something, <laughs> something like that. And uh, down here, that's kind of how it works, and it's uh, it's a little weird, but. At the same time, it's weird that I don't feel scared by it. Maybe it's because there's way better sushi down here. Is that is that right? Hmm. Do we like that like that? Let's do it over here and see what's up. Uh, okay, this one's a different size. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think that actually looks better already. Did I do it on the same axis here? Axis? That's not the correct term the same line alright but yeah so it is kinda crazy it is kinda weird that you know living in the country my whole life and stuff like that not really not really living in a city like I've lived in some populated places I lived in State College Pennsylvania for a while for about four or five years that's where Penn State is and uh, you know there's like 50, 60 at the time there was like 50, 60 thousand students 50,000 students I think 
So there's quite a few people. Um, uh, oh, I think it looks cool. I really like it. I'm really down. I'm down with everything except these pot lights. I like everything except the lights. And actually, these lights... Yeah, I just don't like the lights. Oh, maybe it's cool. Maybe we do like it. I don't know. I like the little blue brick, though. I think it's pretty cool. So don't worry, though. I'm not going to get shot. I'll be safe. It'll be cool. We still got a lot of work to do on this stuff. I tell you what, um, we still got to build a lot of tunnels. We got to go to the boot, and we can actually change these right now because I know what these signs are going to end up saying. So this is going to be the boot. The boot. This is going to be the ambry. which is my storage area. And we don't have a name for the house, and I was actually gonna talk to you about this too. Um, I just don't wanna call it the house. We gotta name the house, guys. Tell me what you think. Oh, and before we go, I actually had one other idea of something we could try to do um, to head up here. But I think what I was going to say, and I kind of lost my train of thought, was that it's kind of weird sometimes being in the area where, like, so much news happens and, like, you know, the White House is, like, down the street. Um, and it, it it's kind of weird because the city's, like, D.C.'s, like, a really amazing city. I mean, it is. I need four of these. How the hell do you make a redstone lamp? I don't know. I'm sorry. I'm going to look it up. I can't remember the recipe off the top of my head. Alright, it's glowstone and... Do I have glowstone? It's right here. Glowstone and then... Four of those bad boys and we get that. We have these. Okay, I wanted to change one more thing about how the uh, how the minecart station actually works. Um, I am trying to put my own spin as much as I can... Ooh, should I make this into lapis too? Fucking right. Ooh, I said the F word. Oh my gosh. Try not to swear. Just because it's more polite. Oh, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Yeah, that was a good decision as well. So what we're going to do here is pop these out like so. And then... I believe I did this um, in my test world to see if we do this. See if we do this. What happens is that the one that the the one that you select is the one that turns off. But all we have to do to fix that is invert the signals. Let's see if we can get up here. You know, we might as well leave a little stairway, a little ghetto stairway right here. But um, if we do this, and I'm pretty sure this should still work perfectly, invert these signals like so. Now, the one that we select should be the one that turns on. I like it. Let's go ahead and hit the branch and head back down and see if it works. I'm liking this area. Oh, I think that lapis was a good idea. I hope that you guys don't hate it, because that would be... Oh, there's a slime back there somewhere. Do you hear it? It looks cool coming down through this area. You do kind of pass through it a little bit fast. And then I'm going to block off the upper stairway there. And another slime. Maybe we'll put lapis at, the, uh, at every intersection. Do I have enough smooth stone to cover this bad boy? I do, I do. So, uh, perhaps we put smooth stone at all of the intersections, at all of the uh, destinations, not smooth stone, all the destinations get lapis, and that's kind of our, that's kind of our indicator that, you know, you're at the minecart station area, or that you're at the, one of the, uh, uh, it was dumb. 
<laughs> you're at one of the areas where the uh, minecart station is. Let's clean this up too. I'm just trying to make stuff a little prettier for everybody to enjoy. And uh, I think it, I really, it's kind of funny because when I first started building, I wasn't, I was kind of like, I don't know why people do that. Like, it doesn't make any sense to make everything beautiful. You're just kind of, you know, you just build it in your world. It doesn't have to be pretty, but it is kind of nice to have it be aesthetically pleasing when you're walking around or hanging out down in these areas. So let's head back up. And we'll see. I think we're going to wrap it up for now. As always, thanks very much for watching. I wanted to go ahead and thank Mr. Rev Reefer for subscribing. Appreciate it. Fist bumps to you, my man. I was watching some of my Borderland tutorials. I uh, appreciate you subscribing very much. Um, as always, hit the like button if you like this video. And uh, you can favorite it too. Uh, you know, I won't complain. Uh, and if it's your first time watching and you want to see more stuff and things, you want to hang out with us, please hit the subscribe button. Thanks very much for watching. Y'all have a great rest of your day. K.I.